Hey everyone, welcome to my channel, The Example. As men, we love to tinker and mod and make things better. We especially love to make things faster. In this video, I'm going to go through how I modded my daughter's Corvette. We're gonna go from six volts to 18 volts. Speed will increase from about two miles per hour to five miles per hour. Now, your wife will be mad for sure, but the smile you put on your kid's face will be worth the trouble. Let's get started. Okay, so first, where did I get the parts? So I got my parts from ML Toys. Um, it's a uh, Power Wheels modding um, store. And um, there I got the C7 Corvette Stingray 6 volt to 12 volt conversion kit. I also ordered their uh, 18 volt battery kit and a plug and play system. So basically um, they sent all the wiring and just plug and play. Or so I thought, we'll get to that later. So here I've removed the seat, exposing the two motors and it, the wires are running to the gearbox. What we're gonna do now is remove that gearbox and replace it with the new gearbox from the conversion kit we got from ML Toys. So here we have to remove this panel here and the pedal. So here's the pedal. And uh, if you look down here, here's that wiring harness going from the gearbox all the way to the front of the car. I'm gonna remove this to, um, to so we can put the new battery from the six volt plug to a 18 volt plug. So next we have to remove, we, we have to remove the window from the car. Well, what looks like a window. And you see here, we have a, a couple of screws that we have to go around this car and remove. Here, here, here's another one. And here's the plug, the wiring harness running from the gearbox, motors, and here's the plug, powers the old six volt battery out of remote. All right, now we have the wiring harness exposed. All we have to do now is make some quick cuts or snips right before the electrical motors. So what you're gonna need now is some wire cutters and quick connects. You can get those from O'Reilly Auto Parts or Advance Auto. Make sure when you're getting them from O'Reilly or Advance that they're the right size that match the harness female connectors that are on the mltoys.com provided harness. So again, you wanna make sure that the harness, the female connectors on the harness provided from ML Toys match the quick connects that you get from O'Reilly. Okay, so let's look at the finished product here. So you see I have the quick connects here and here and I've uh, matched up all the wires and we have the new wiring harness and gearbox all connected. Everything buttoned down here are the two um, motors, excuse me, batteries from mltoys.com with a new harness and battery connector. Excuse the mess. Um, don't do this. What I did was I took the motor that was on the Corvette, I just snatched them off and that did not work. Um, don't do that. I destroyed that motor, but thankfully, um, you see here, here's the, I should have just uh, snipped and those are soldered on, don't do that. So, but thankfully, um, I had a Lightning McQueen 12 volt car that my son had, and it's just been sitting in the backyard um, uh, collecting uh, dust. So I went out, got those motors, cleaned them off, and uh, thankfully those motors were in interchangeable and they work. So um, that's what I have in the car now. And, um, and that's it. So I hope you enjoyed this quick tutorial and um, make sure you put a helmet on your kid. And um, in the next part, I'll, be, I'll show you uh, how much fun Tegan is having with her faster Corvette. 
Now here's the finished product. So here's Tegan and my son. We're out at the park and we are testing out this new speed. Next, I'll be adding LED lights to the Corvette. But right now I'm really satisfied with the new speed and Tegan is having a blast. And yes, my wife is concerned. All right. Oh, that was fun. I like that. You like it? Come on. What you doing? Oh, come give me a hug. You getting out? Huh? Where you going? To the car? Come on! <laughs> 